so here we go so today we are going to start off with acids bases and salts but first let's take a look at acids okay what is an acid acid is anything which when dissolved in water gives us hydronium ion anything that gives us hydronium ion is known as an acid take it now how does this hydronium ion come about hydronium ion comes when h a that is the acid breaks down to give us h positive and a negative and this h positive when it combines with water it gives us h 3 o positive okay so this is the basic of an acid clear okay now acids can be of two types okay acids can be a mineral acid or an acid could be an organic acid now any acid that we prepare in the lab or we get on the earth is a mineral acid like hcl what is the full form of hcl h2so4 No, H2SO4 is H2SO4 is no HNO3 HNO nitric as taken nitric acid and then uh, H2CO3. carbonic acid okay <laughs> so these these are some of the simple mineral acids and if you look at organic acids this is an acid which we find in everybody's kitchen vinegar and vinegar is also known by the name of acetic acid okay in your citrus fruits you get your citric acid citric acid is also an acid okay which is found in the fruits then you have let's say oxalic acid oxalic acid you get from uh, tomatoes then you have let's say tartaric acid tartaric acid you get from tamarind all these things can be got from living things so that is why they are known as organic acids. Basically, organic acids are any of the acids which have a COOH at the end. They are known as organic acids. So this classification is fine. Now, now we can further divide these acids into two more types. We can divide it as our strong acids. Okay. And the other one will be known as a weak acid. So a strong acid and a weak acid. Now a strong acid is someone like HCl, which completely breaks down to give us H positive and Cl negative. Like HNO3. HNO3 completely breaks down to give us H positive and NO3 negative. And then we have our sulfuric acid, H2SO4, completely breaks down to give us 2H positive and SO4 2 negative. But weak acids, okay, weak acids like carbonic acid, they are reversible in nature. So they do not completely ionize. They will give us all the three things in the solution, the acid, as well as the H positive, as well as the carbonic. Similar is the case with our ethanoic acid. In ethanoic acid also, it is a weak acid. It will give us a CH3COO negative as well as an H positive with CH3COOH. Okay, now all these H positives are going to combine with water to give us H3O positive. So this classification is also clear. Now, now let's look at some properties of an acid. An acid turns blue litmus to red. 
ठीक है हैव यू डन दिस टेस्ट एवर ठीक है सो इट टर्न्स ब्लू लिटमस रेड एसिड्स आर सार इन टेस्ट दैट इज वाई एवरी सिट्रस फ्रूट ऑरेंजेस योर लेमन ऑल ऑफ देम आर सार इन टेस्ट ओके एसिड्स आर करोसिव इन नेचर ओके व्हाट इज करोसिव इन नेचर इट रस्टेड इज समथिंग एल्स रस्टेड इज विथ आयरन ओनली Corrosive means if it falls on your hand, your skin will start burning. Okay, so corrosive in nature. So this part of acid is clear. Now let's look at a base. Now a base can be written in simple terms as a BOH, which when dissolved in water gives us a B positive and an OH negative. so when we get an oh negative a hydroxyl ion it is known as a base so what is a base it gives us what arjun base gives us a hydroxyl ion base gives us what okay now now we can have again we can have strong bases okay and weak bases yeah strong bases are like let's say naoh okay koh and weak bases are like let's say caoh whole twice okay or nh4oh now in strong bases what happens is they completely ionize to give us na positive and oh negative and this one will give us what koh will give us what oh negative and here it will become a reversible process okay so when it is reversible process it means that it is not undergoing complete ionization so it is going to give us a ca2 positive plus 2 oh 1 minus okay ab try the next one nh4 oh will give us what nh4 positive hey shabash theek hai now acids are bitter in taste acids are what in taste bitter theek hai karela have you eaten bitter gourd karela theek hai so it is basic in nature okay uh, bases turn red litmus to blue and strong bases are also corrosive in nature ठीक है नाउ लेट्स लुक एट द नेक्स्ट वन नेक्स्ट वन इज आवर सॉल्ट नाउ हाउ इज अ सॉल्ट फॉर्म व्हेन हा वो तो आयोडाइज सॉल्ट है दैट इज समथिंग एल्स ओके सो सी लुक एट दिस व्हेनेवर एन एसिड रिएक्ट्स विद अ बेस इट गिव्स अ सॉल्ट एंड वाटर so if i have an hcl with an naoh it is going to give us nacl plus h2o theek hai so what is happening basically is this na goes with the cl so it forms an hcl double displacement reaction okay now tell me the next one let's see an hcl plus a uh, koh what is it going to give us mm -hmm. h2 perfect okay now let's look at another one 
tell me now HCl plus NH4OH, what is it going to give us? Perfect. Okay. Now let's take any other acid. Let's take sulfuric acid. H2SO4 with NaOH. What is it going to give us? Yeah. Na2SO4. H2O, always H2O, water. Yeah, 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 please. Okay. 